Hello Capricorn, it's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot, and I'm coming to do your weekly reading. Ooh, 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 something is hidden from you, lies and sinkers. <clears throat> okay, so I'm coming to do your weekly reading for August 21st through August 28th, 2017. Okay, so I feel like what's hidden from you is somebody said that there's your baby and it ain't. Okay, mm. or... Somebody saying they're pregnant and it's not, or somebody, I think somebody, some of you jumped the gun, telling telling people you're pregnant and you ain't yet. All right, um, cards by Lucy Cavendish. I close off with my Miss Cleo cards. All right, what's going on for the? Thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, send up personal readings if you want one. Check in the description box below. Thank you guys for your donations as well. Okay, let's go on. Capricorn, Capricorn, Capricorn. What's going on with the Capricorn for the week of? August 21st through 28, 2017. Okay. So, weight's lifted. Yeah, I guess if somebody trying to stick a baby on you and, and you find out you ain't or you find out you ain't pregnant by somebody you really don't want, that's a burden lifting. Lifted, but that's just the overall feeling of it. All right. All right, so it's um, burdens lifting about something that's been keeping you up at night. What is this dream card about? All right, so whatever it is, it's got to do with somebody just coming and leaving and coming and leaving. This person is always leaving you and it's keeping you up at night. So, yeah, this is an arrogant person. So maybe somebody demasculate you or this person just feel demasculated by you. All right, yeah, so this situation ain't looking too good for the future. All right. Okay, so you're still in this situation because you love this person. Um, I feel like nothing was told yet, so hopefully the um, Cleo cards will let something out. But it's basically just saying somebody, some kind of weights have been lifted off of people. Somebody is done in their mind thinking about something about somebody who's in and out a, a, a um a arrogant person or maybe somebody told you that they think you arrogant and it's saying it's not looking for good for the future but you love this person okay so what i don't know what's going on here but whatever's going on about to happen real fast let's see what these burdens are about now since everything else out. what are these burdens about for the capricorn what are these burdens about for the capricorn for the week of 8, 21 through 28, 2017. Love reading. Where are these burdens lifted about? Okay, so it might be about a job. Somebody talking crap about you. I don't know why I said that. Because that's not what the cards say. But it's something going on with the job that lifted some burdens. Okay. So, some kind of baggage. What is going on here? It's not telling me anything. All right. What is going on with the work burden and baggage? All right. <laughs> okay. So, somebody is not seeing something is going on at work for what it is. But I feel like whatever is unseen will be seen soon. And it's going to be quick. So, in the next couple of days, maybe you're going to... Oh, Jesus. This is terrible. Okay. I don't know what's going on here, but it, it makes no sense. So, there's something going on at work. Um, maybe somebody trying to protect you from something, or you're trying to protect somebody else from something. But it's two people trying to protect one. And there's something going on with some baggage that somebody got. So... Um, somebody's saying that you have baggage, but this uh, it's a general reading, so it can go both ways. So, basically, somebody's saying that you got baggage, but you're not trying to look at this baggage for what it is. And then, that weight being lifted, it got it's something that you keep thinking about, about somebody who's in and out your life. Whoever this person is, they demasculate you, but you love them. And you want them to open your heart to you. But it's saying it's not looking too good for the future in that. Okay, what's at the bottom? All right, yeah, so you're not sleeping with this person, whoever this is. All right, 
right, let's see what Cleo got to say. What's, what's going on? Okay, so some of you, this might be some kind of job loss or something. These cards are shooting right out today. Wow. So, I mean, when I see this card, I feel like somebody is um, just spending a lot of money. Like, they're not in the place where they have to just be nickel and diamond all the time. Like, oh, that costs $2. I don't want it. That's too much. All right, what's going on with the Capricorn love reading? Capricorn love reading for the week of August 28th through 21st, 2017. August 28th through 21st, 2017 love reading. Jesus, what is this? I got to do it again now. So this just reminds me of a dishonest boss. Somebody just always lying and manipulating and switching stuff around to make it look like he did something wrong. All right. All right, Capricorn, love reading. Capricorn, Capricorn, Capricorn. This week, please give us a love reading. What's going on in these other cards? What is going on? Okay, so somebody is weak right now, and they're hoping. What are they hoping? All right, so I think somebody's weakened and they hoping they ain't got to shovel out some money for something. Y'all got to tell me what is going on with this. All right, if we're going to go back to the beginning, I feel like somebody may have gotten somebody pregnant at work. Or maybe somebody got somebody pregnant that they separated from or got pregnant by somebody that they separated from. But I feel like somebody started a whole new relationship already. And they in the relationship with somebody they care for. And I think once this secret come out, it's going to blow up everything. That's just what I'm feeling. But I I don't know what's going on here. Let me just, um, please let me know. All right, what's going on with this Leo? I mean, this uh, strength card. All right, strength card reverse, indecision and weakness, okay? Then you got the star card. Star card, star card, star card. It's upright, it says, a great time for hope for the future, a reflection of achievements, a time to look at your life with great hope for the future. Good things are on their way, a wonderful card. Okay, then you have the coin. Man, you got a lot of stuff going on here. All right, the Queen of Coins is reversed. It says, secretive, false compliments, mean-spirited, and judgmental. So, okay, then we got the two of staffs. Two of staffs. You guys are going to have to let me know what this is talking about. Because I have no idea. I mean, I can understand the feelings and I can understand how being all over the place like this could have you like not being able to sleep and being in, in, in your emotions. Okay, look at this. So it is, this is probably, I feel like this is about a baby. Let me read this to a staff. All right, so loss of wealth and position as a result of excessive vanity. So, yeah, I think somebody might have jumped the gun on the baby situation here. Or, um, yeah, somebody might have got somebody pregnant that they're not dealing with no more. But that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. If you want a personal reading, check in the description box below. Um, thanks for your donations and likes and everything. And you guys have a wonderful week.